Uh, welcome to the show, and also welcome to NBC. Thank you. Uh, I'm so thrilled to be here. You have no idea. You, know, you, you you've been called the, the godfather of, of fantasy football, uh, and uh, you've done a lot of cool things. I think one of the coolest things is that you helped a lot of the Avengers, the in the Marvel Cinematic Universe, play fantasy football. Yes. And you, you in fact, they liked you so was, much. So you're I in. I was texting with Chris Pratt today. He wants to know Elijah Mitchell, or Rashad Penny, Week One. Elijah Mitchell's the answer. Wow. I'm just saying. Really? Yeah. Well, here you are in in a pretty massive scene of Avengers Endgame. This is Robert Redford, you, Robert Downey Jr., and Chris Hemsworth. And did you, I, I, I'm, not, I'm not being rude, did you have a speaking line in the? I, I had four lines, yes. believe it or not. Like, no, when you watch it, Jimmy, when you watch it back, because I know that's what you're going to do tonight, just put on the closed caption. Okay. I'm only on camera for one of them, three big stars, but I got four lines. I'm in the cast. Really? Yeah. So you're on yeah. IMDb, you're in the cast. I am in the, I am in the cast. I'm part of the MCU. I'm canon. There, I have my own page <laughs> on the Marvel Wiki. Come on. <laughs> I'm, I'm, yeah. That's yeah. fantastic. That's a good. I, is that your only film you've been in? Yes, it is. And by the way, so Avengers Endgame, as you guys know, is the highest grossing movie of all time worldwide. Mm -hmm. Okay? And it's the only movie I've been in. So, <laughs> I mean, people want to talk about Tom Cruise or The Rock and their total box office, but I'm just saying, if you look at the stats, which is what I do, <laughs> on a per movie basis, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm the highest grossing actor of all time worldwide. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> This is amazing. Uh, no big deal. No, 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 no big deal. Numbers are numbers. I'm just saying. I'm, I've retired from movies. I'm never going to do it. So yeah. until some movie beats Avengers Endgame, like, I'm the guy. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I want to talk to you about the, the fantasy football uh, yeah. and, and, and when it got popular. And did you ever see yourself as being the top analyst or, the, or even having a career based on fantasy football? When you were a kid? No, you know, I do, I do these interviews sometimes and people say, like, oh, is this your dream job? I'm like, yeah. no. When, when I was dreaming of jobs, this didn't exist. You know what I mean? Like, fantasy football was like, was like a sports version of Dun Dungeons & Dragons. Like, it was this nerdy niche thing. And so the idea that I could somehow make a living wearing makeup, being on TV, talking about fake football <laughs> was, you know, asinine to me. And, you know, so the fact that... The fact that I was in Avengers Endgame, the, the fact that I'm on The Tonight Show. I'm on The Tonight Show with Jimmy Fallon. Yeah. better than that. Yeah. I mean, right? Like, I'm happy. This, this, is, this is cool. Uh, I, I'm happy here. Now, you're also you're involved with, you're, you're part of Football Night in America. You're on the team now. Yeah. Here at NBC. So now, yeah, we shame, this share, share the same locker room. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so, uh, uh, but after the show, weirdly, tonight, I, the Tonight Show staff, we're all getting together, we're doing the fantasy football draft. I have no idea what I'm doing. And okay. so every I year... can help. This is what I do. Yeah. We're colleagues now. Yeah. You can, you can email me. I can? can. I'll get you your... I'll get my number to you. You'll text me. Yeah. Yeah. Because, listen, it's the Tonight Show with Jimmy Fallon League. Yeah. Jimmy Fallon can't finish last. We can't have you doing some sort of punishment or anything like that. Like, like I feel like we need to get you to the playoffs, but not win. Like, so you look good, <laughs> but you don't... But you don't crush staff morale. Oh, I, I mean, you're the star. Yeah, yeah, yeah very you're smart. You're the star. So yeah, you don't like... want me to win. Right, right. But just is, get is far there... enough to show that I could win. Yeah, exactly, you could win, and you're just sort of taking it easy. Just for anyone watching, the first one, everyone's like, oh, you got to get... Right. Well, so I know... So I... <laughs> I talked to your producer backstage. Oh. You have the second pick. You have pick two this year. I have pick two. This so is a big deal. Right. So most That's likely, good. Jonathan Taylor will go one. He's the Colts running back. Had a great season last year. Of course. So my question to you is, what kind of player are you? Like, do you want to be risk averse? Or are you going to swing for the fences? Because I'm a believer in, you know, Ricky Bobby from Talladega Nights. Like, if you ain't first, you're last, right? If I were right. you at pick two, I'm taking Chris McCaffrey, who is, who's been hurt the last two years, but when he is healthy, has been the best player in fantasy football. So, again, it's a, it's a risk-reward pick. That's what I would do it to. That's why I've ranked number two. Uh, now, when, when you say things like this, does it throw the numbers like crazy? I, Maybe. Somewhat, yeah. I, mean, I yeah. don't know. I, you know, yes. I mean, I'm, so I'm you, flattered that a lot of people that, pay attention to what, what I say. So you can make up a name. You're like, oh, you got to get uh, yeah. a Skip Benson. Yeah, right, yeah. And you go... <laughs> Dougal, Dougal McGillicuddy, yeah. running back, is a sleeper. And, you know, so... <laughs> yeah, but, uh, but most people... Mo in the fantasy football industry, most people have McCaffrey at number two or one. Yeah. Okay. So that's, that's not a controversial co uh, take by me. So you will help me out? I will help you out. I'm I've so got excited. your back. I by, by, by the way, do you want to win? I mean, like, you can... Because... Because, like, yeah, I mean, if you yes. want to, I, I will help you crush your staff like a grape. <laughs> I don't know. But let's do it. Yes! Like, I was, yes! I was trying to be nice. That's what I'm talking about. The roots are I'm coming out. I'm taking Kamal out. I'm taking Kamal out.
Uh, Matthew Berry, I appreciate you, buddy. Thank hey. you so much. Thanks for having me, Thanks for being here. My pleasure. Matthew Berry, watch Fantasy Football Happy Hour weekdays on Peacock. Hey, hey.